be waiting in a place that nobody thought to look. It's entirely possible that your next car could run off of biodiesel produced by microalgae. Algae are the original oil producers on Earth. This oil is very similar to the oil that comes straight out of the ground. Algae can double its cell mass every few hours. It goes from one cell to two cells to four cells to eight. It grows so quickly that we can go from the cells on this plate to a flask to a large-scale industrial fermenter of hundreds of thousands of liters in a span of days. How did you guys come up with the idea for this company? Harrison and I met our first day of college. Flash forward a few years, Harrison develops the idea to use microalgae to produce biofuel to take a 150 million year process, which is what it takes to make oil that we use in our cars right now, and we condense it to three days. And we end up with oil that, when burned, doesn't add additional carbon dioxide into the atmosphere. What is this machine, and what am I looking at in here? You're looking at a green barrel of oil. This is algae uh, producing oil. We take strains of algae and we optimize them for maximum oil productivity, and we put them into these fermenters, which mimic the large-scale production process. You can make all of the things from a regular barrel of oil from this oil. You can make household cleaning supplies, jet fuel, diesel fuel, industrial chemicals, plastics. But I don't see a way for sunlight to get into this, this cylinder. How is this working? All algae are photosynthetic organisms, but we don't actually produce oil through a direct sunlight process. We actually feed sugar to the algae. They're a thousand times more productive at making oil when you feed them sugar than feeding them sunlight. The process works on non-food feedstocks like corn stover, switchgrass, wood chips, and sugar cane. This is a much cheaper way to make renewable energy. And our biodiesel production partners tell us that this is the highest quality oil they've ever seen. Wow, it's nice and dark. Look at that. Wow. This stuff's very oily. Can I taste it? Sure. Wow, it tastes like peanut oil. We actually developed this solar diesel so that it would run in pre-existing infrastructure. And that means from refinery, to pipeline, to gas station, to car. Vegetation is your fuel. This fuel is great performance. Vegetation is your fuel. It runs better than Hetra diesel. You get more power. It's cleaner burning. Vegetation is your fuel. We're driving around San Francisco right now on algal biodiesel. I have a two-year-old daughter. I want her to understand when she's older the impact that this is really going to have on her life and everyone's life. We need these kinds of energy solutions. Vegetation is your fuel.